<laughs> you know who it is, and you know what time it is. Time to piss off some feminist trad cucks and whoever don't want to know the truth. Oh well, let's get started. What is going on, gents? It's RPM here, reporting from Mobile Command. Happy New Year to all of you newly minted, maniacal motherfuckers who will have zero fucks to give from today. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Terrence Pop made a video a long time ago, the give a fuck scale. We talked about the damn shit and fuck bags. Gentlemen, empty those bags out for this year. Why? Because why even bother having them to give in the first place? This society is burning to the ground. Let the motherfucker burn. Are you trying to save it? Are you trying to save these raggedy ass women out here? If the answer to that is no, guess what? You're on the path to your own personal enlightenment. Oh yeah. The best thing to do, let go. Don't try to save it. Don't try to save fucked up relationships. Don't try to save damaged, broken people. Especially damaged, broken women. Oh, no, 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 no. This is a new damn year. Act like it. Take risks. Take a new option. There's no more excuses. Fellas, if you have a friend that's going to complain to you about problems that they had last year, this year, shut them down. Shut them the fuck down. Say, look, if you're not ready to solve said problem, I don't want to hear about it. I'm not going to be your emotional dumping ground. Am I sympathetic? Yes. However, I'm not going to listen to the same damn problems. You need to take charge. If it's a woman, are you ready to leave her? Well, no. Okay. I don't want to hear about it. Come back to me when you're ready to solve that problem. Period. Point blank. The world is open. Fellas, we all know about the problems that happened last year and the year before that and the year before that. Why do you want to keep that same headache? Why do you want to keep that same toxic, you know, feeling? This problem is this. This problem is that. No. If you don't want to solve that problem, then guess what? That means somehow, some way, you want to keep that problem. Why? Because you want to keep yourself in a state of victimhood. Unfortunately, women are the masters of victimhood. Gentlemen, you know what you need to do. If you've got a disrespectful woman, you know what you need to do. Walk out that damn door. She wants to go to the streets. Wish her well. Say, thank you. Go to the streets. However, you know, you can never come back to me. Gentlemen, start dumping women in 2024. Start dumping them. She wants to be all over social media. Oh, you know what? Cool. I don't accept that. You can do all, all you want, but guess what? You can do it without me. All of this one-itis? No, gentlemen, no. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Break those mental chains. You know what you need to do. New year, new options. 
no excuses. If you're thinking about, you know what? Maybe I'm considering the synthetic companion life. Do it. If you're thinking about, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and go monk mode for a month to try it out. Do it. If you're thinking to yourself, you know what? I want to visit another country. Do it. <laughs> Gentlemen, the only limit you have are the limits that you place on yourself. Period. No more listening to miserable people saying, oh man, you know, I wouldn't do that. You know what, motherfucker? I'm not you. Guess what? I'm going to do this. Be proud of your decisions. Be bold with your decisions. Anybody who will tell you, man, I wouldn't do that, or you need to look out for this, man, cut them the fuck off. They're miserable, and they want to keep you miserable. Remember, gentlemen, misery loves company. However, going back to your damn shit and fuck bags, empty those bags out. If somebody says to you, oh, well, you know, you should watch out if you go to this country because, man, fuck you. Have you been there? No, shut the fuck up. I don't want to hear it. If something bad happens to me, guess what? I assume the risk. Yes, gentlemen, you have to assume the risk. No risk, no reward. Hey, it is what it is. You got to get out of your own way. You've got to cut off negative people. This year, hey, if it's a party of one, so be it. Let it be a party of one. There's nobody that's going to go with you when it's your time to go. I've never seen a casket built for two. So yeah, make calculated risks. Make your risk assessment, wherever, whatever you're going to do. If you're going to go to the JUCO, hey, make those risk assessments. Hell, I got a text from Mama-san yesterday saying, oh, we're going to be open on Monday. And we've got a new rotation of ladies. <laughs> so you know what that means later today? Oh, straight to the parlor. Yes, Ling Ling Cheeks will be clapped. <laughs> Why? Because I don't give a fuck. I'm going to live my life the way I see fit. Gentlemen, you should have the same mentality moving forward. Fuck what everybody else says. If you want people in your inner circle to know your business, that's on you. If not, if they ask, Fuck them. Say, no, nah, that's not your business. Don't worry about it. Because we all know far too many people will be trying to use anything that they can against you later in life. Nah, start cutting people off. Start dumping women. Hey, if your job is being disrespectful, you know what? Search for another job. Leave that job. Gentlemen, do not accept anything that's going to fuck up your peace. Period. You've got peace. You've got serenity. You've got tranquility. Anything that would threaten that needs to be cut off. And guess what? You don't need to explain. However, however, I will say this, if you're going to dump a woman, you need to tell her why you're dumping her. See, one thing that we all know about women, when they want to leave a relationship, they want to make sure they have the court of public opinion on their side. Gentlemen, I made a video a long time ago called, you're going to be the bad guy regardless. Okay, be the bad guy. However, if you're going to be the bad guy, be the bad guy on your terms. 
You tell that woman, this is why we're breaking up. You've got a shitty attitude. You're all over social media. I'm not going to accept that. So guess what? You can go. There are billions more of you on this planet. So yeah, one-itis, fellas, you got to kill that. If you know a guy that's still paying for only simps, guess what? You look at him, you say, you're an idiot. And until you're ready to stop that, you know what? I'm going to keep you at a distance. Yes, fellas, distance yourself from negative influences, no matter who they are, because we all know family can be one of the biggest negative influences. Yeah. Cut people off. Remember the three bags, your damn bag, your shit bag, and your fuck bag. Empty them out for 2024. Empty them the fuck out. Don't take shit from people. Do not take disrespect. Somebody's disrespecting you in public, you know what you do? You get up and you walk the fuck out. Period. Walk the fuck out of wherever you are. And if you're in public, walk away. Bye. That's just it. You're not going to get any younger. Shout out to Dennis Sperling for one of his sayings. I got more life behind me than I do in front of me. Gentlemen, hey, you're not going to get any younger. Therefore, you should not be stressing yourself out. When things are ready to end, end them. That's all you can do. And remember, gentlemen, the two most powerful things that you can do towards women. One is say no. And two, walk away. Leave. You're going to be the bad guy regardless. So be the bad guy on your terms. Well, I've rambled on long enough. Let me know what you guys think. What's going to be your plans for this year? What changes do you intend to make? How do you intend to move in this new society that we're in? Put it in the comment section. And for you women out there around the world, 2024 is about to be very, very interesting because I believe this is the year of Zulu Foxtrot Golf. For all you civvies out there, ZFG, zero fucks given. More and more men, in my humble opinion, will free themselves. And when you're free, gentlemen, you are un stoppable. The system can no longer contain you. And that has always been the biggest fear when it comes to the everyday average man. Once you know your worth, once you know your value, guess what? All the chains that are holding you on this plantation, they will snap. It is what it is. So yes, ladies, all of the quote unquote power you think you have that is going out feminism which honestly i think it's actually on the ropes why because there are so many publications that are putting out articles that have upset the feminists yeah i think feminism it's weakened but it's on its way out too because trust and believe as more men free themselves, yeah, those resources attached to those men will be free as well. <laughs> it is what it is. That's all I got to say for this one. RPM, I am out.